Okay guys, so I promised you two videos and here's my second one. So my next one is going to be 10 things that really annoy me that people do. So let's get started. I'm going to put it right here because I can't remember everything. So the first thing, when people walk slowly in front of you. Now I don't know if anyone else has this problem, but since I'm in middle school, uh, there are lit, like when I was in sixth grade, eighth graders would do it. But now it seems like now that I'm in eighth graders, sixth graders and seventh graders are doing it. And it's really, it's always annoyed me ever since I was a sixth grader. And I was just like her ex, and it only happens when I'm hurrying for class. Like, everyone walks slowly when I'm trying to get, like, when I'm trying to get to class quickly because I'm like slow at packing my books or something. And it just like really annoys me because they're literally like in a pack, like filling the whole hallway. And it's like, they're just sitting there or they're just like talking and walking slowly and it annoys me so much and okay, so the next thing that annoys me is when people smack their food while eating i have food right here because i was actually in the middle of eating uh, so i'll give you an example or when people like chew with their mouth open like, that's not attractive. What are you doing that for? That, that annoys me. It's just like, and it's like after they eat. Like, what are you trying to do? Get, like, the flavoring back? Like, you already ate it. Like, what is wrong with you? Just take another bite of it. Like, I don't know. Uh, that just really annoys me when people smack and chew with their mouth open. I don't know. This is a school people problem, not really an adult people problem. Um, when people yell at the at another person from across the room before class. If you're in middle school or high school, you probably know what I'm talking about. But literally, if someone is like over here, and then the other person's like on the other side of the room, they're just like, hey! Blah, 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 what you doing? How you doing? Hey, come over here, let's talk. Like, seriously? What's wrong with you? You're, it's like, or some people do it, like, during class. Like, if we're doing nothing, people will just like, Hey, dude, what's up? You, yeah? Yeah, I know, she's, a, like, like, no. No, please stop screaming across the room. Save that for lunch or for recess or for homeroom or for the end of the day. I'm pretty sure that nobody has to hear it right then. Please and thank you. This is an everyday problem happens to everyone. When people judge you for how you wear your hair or what you wear and stuff like that. Hey, that just rhymed. But anyway, when people judge you for like how you wear your hair, like... In fifth grade, I wore my pigtails and a hair, and I I wore pigtails in my hair every single day, like I'm doing now. Like I love pigtails. Don't don't judge me. I love pigtails. And every single day, my like people that I don't like or people that don't like me, they're just like, why are you wearing pigtails? What's wrong with you? Like like what's like why are you wearing pigtails that's so like stuck in grade i'm just like well sorry i like wearing pigtails they're nice and pretty and i like them so why are you judging me or like what you wear like you're wearing like a t-shirt and sweatpants to school one day and someone's just like oh yeah why are you wearing that like you can you're so like nobody wears sweatpants to school that's for like a weekend like sorry i was feeling like I want, I was feeling like I wanted to be comfortable. I don't want to wear jeans and a shirt and like a really frilly shirt every day. Sometimes I want to wear a t-shirt and some sweatpants. So sorry, if I'm just trying to be myself. I'm not here to impress you anyway. Thank you very much. I don't know if this has happened to anyone else, but when people call you wimps for crying, 
Um, comment down below if that's ever happened to you. I'm not sure if I'm the only one that that's happened to. But if you're just, like, crying, and I'm a crier. I cry all the time. Don't, don't judge me for that. Don't call me a wimp, because that will exactly be... That will annoy me. So, anyway, um, like, if I'm crying over, like, if I got hurt, and they're just like, Oh, yeah, you're such a wimp. Like, who cries over getting hit in the head with a basketball which I have gotten before um and I'm just like what what's I I'm a, I'm a crier I'm sensitive I don't like being hit on the head with the basketball like what's wrong with you I do not know what you're doing why are you calling me a wimp you're a wimp for saying that I'm a wimp because uh, I don't know that just annoys me is there, is there anyone else that, that annoys or is it just me? Comment down below, please. Okay, number six. I just started counting, okay. When people think that they can do something and they can't, and they do it constantly until it annoys the crap out of you. Um, I don't know if that ever has happened to you, but it has to me. Like, if someone thinks they can sing and they're just like, ah. Wait, what song? Are you ready for, ready for a perfect storm? Perfect? Like, really? Why are you, why are you trying? Like, I'm not saying, like, don't go follow your dreams. Don't do what you want. But if you're doing something that annoys other people especially if people do it on purpose if people just do it constantly on purpose to annoy you oh my gosh that grinds my gear so much i don't know that anyone else and i'm not like saying like oh well, yeah if you're terrible at something don't do it that's not what i'm saying at all it's just like it's something just saying it annoys me if you're doing it on purpose and you do it constantly over and over and over same song and you're like I don't know I'm a singer I like to sing so if you're like ruining a song for me it kind of makes me sad and annoyed so I don't know that's just me though Seven. when people on Instagram or Twitter or any other social media show off their body for attention I don't know if that's happened to anyone else like if anyone's seen that but when people show like when girls show their like super flat stomach and how skinnier they are or when guys show their abs and stuff like that unless you have really good abs like like if unless you're like a celebrity like a really hot celebrity i'm fine with that but when people just like do it randomly it's just like Okay, thank you for showing us your body. I don't really need to see that though. Save that for something else. Please don't do show that to people that you don't know. Because there might be a pervert following you. I don't know. But anyway, that really annoys me. Um, pulling my hair from my pony. Okay, <laughs> whatever. Um, but yeah, that annoys me. So, my next one is snobby people. I'm not, I know I'm not the only one that gets annoyed by snobby people. Because it happens to everyone. People are just like, oh yeah, I'm so fabulous and you're so like not. And I'm so totally amazing. Like, why are you even here? Why are you at this party? Because it's my party. Like, I like own this whole place and it's like you're you're in the school or something i own this whole place like this place is mine strutting around in like your high heels and your pretty dresses and just being like i am fabulous i own the world no no please please stop you're not cool and you probably don't own the world either, unless your dad's like the president. And I don't think your dad's the president. So, whatever. When guys call girls basic, like basic white girl, like, okay. Uh, like, 
every girl likes Starbucks and selfies. Like, I don't care what you say. Every girl likes Starbucks and selfies. <sighs> Starbucks is good. Sometimes I have a hankering and a craving for Starbucks. And I like selfies. Every girl likes to take selfies. They like to feel good about themselves. So they take selfies and then post on Instagram. I mean, or like Twitter or something. I mean, that's just a normal thing. I don't know. And basic is like if you get Starbucks every single day or every single week and you post it on Instagram and you post like a million kajillion selfies every day, like that's basic. So guys, if you don't know what basic is, don't call, call girls that. Because there's one guy I know calls me basic every day just because I like Starbucks. No. Thank you very much, but no. Sorry. Not sorry. Okay, so the last one is obviously haters. Sorry, but no. You're nothing but a hater, and I don't care what you say. Because I know my flaws, and you don't have to point them out to me. Yes, haters annoy me to death. If I see someone giving hate on some random person that they probably don't even know, especially celebrities, I see hate on their pages all the time, especially like the ones I love. And it annoys me so much. Like, seriously, what's wrong with you? Why are you judging people for what they like and what they do and what they wear and how they look and how they feel and what they watch, what they, uh, everything. People are just sort of so judgy lately. And I don't know what's wrong with it, but, oh my God, haters are so annoying. I'm, s all right, uh, yeah. Um, <sighs> haters. I'm pretty sure that annoys everyone now. I'm sorry. I just got like really, really, really. By the way, if you give me hate on this video, you will see my wrath. I will make a video the next day about how much I hate haters. It's gonna be worse than this, okay? So no hate, please, and thank you. I hate haters. That's it for this video. Make sure to like and subscribe. And um, check out the video I made earlier. Because it's me singing Dark Horse. So yeah, I hope you guys like this video. Um, make sure to comment down below if any of the things that annoy me about people annoy you. So... Yeah, I'm gonna go. I love you guys so much. You guys are totally amazing. Um, so yeah. See you guys later.